Man, boss man says don't drive this thing that fast. He don't know anything. We are all good. Well, let's see. Let's see. Can we get in a higher gear? Come on. Let's see how quick we can get this thing going. Only 22. Oh, man. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. What just happened? What just happened? happen oh uh oh that's going to be expensive hello everyone this is stevio here we are paying the bills we got a lot of bills to pay this is our first major job and we got the big John Deere Batwing out today. Uh, this is the first job I took that I can actually use this. I'm kind of excited. It's the first time I'm breaking my cherry on the new green, the green paint here. We do have the little 6 series here, the 6410. I'm hoping this thing has enough ponies for that thing. I know some of this grass is kind of ridiculous around here. That's why I kind of decided I could make a go of run for this business. But let me tell you what, when you're running a business, man oh man do the bills pile up. Just getting all the supplies for the year, like the mower blades, diesel, etc., is pretty daunting of a task. I am a little bit intimidating when I'm doing this type of thing because let me tell you, it just seems like money is flowing out and nothing, nothing at all is really coming in. All right, so they need to clean up around the end of this bridge. So we're gonna start in right here. Unfold the bat wing. Turn off the blinkers. All right. Will it make a banging noise? Nope. No banging noise today. All right, and we are off. Well, oh, 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 I got so excited, I hit a tree. Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm breaking the cherry of the new tractor, and all I do is uh, leave green paint on the tree here. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm going downhill. Is that my phone? What is it at? Hello? Hello, Stevia. This is Mike. There's an accident on Route 69. We uh, need you. Say that again? Looks like a big tractor tried to take down a bridge. Oh, really? Load up your genie and get over here. Where's this bridge at? Route 69. Listen, dummy. All right. All right. Just so you know, I'm in the middle of a mow job. I'm going to have to road this thing back, but I'll get there as quick as possible. I'm hoping in five, probably more like ten, though. All right, I'm in route. Well, that was short-lived, very short-lived. I kind of made a fruit of the limb uh, purchase because uh, I kind of like them, to be honest. They're kind of fun to drive around. Uh, if you ever have to hang up Christmas tree lights, you can always use them. You know, Genie Man Lifts, you'd be amazed at how much you would actually use one until you have it. And just for playing around, it is kind of fun. It's especially fun when you're trying to uh, prank your colleagues. They leave their coat or hat, you know, behind one day. Perfect prank machine. You could put it at the hardest reach positions. And when they're in the basket, you can take control of the ground controls and really make them change their pants, if you know what I mean. And how did I already get dirt on my tractor? I literally used it less than five minutes. I, I drove on hard-packed roads to get there. Where exactly did this dirt come from? Must have been some pretty dusty type mowing, I guess. 
All right. This is our genie. The genie. The magic genie. It's a S60. Uh, I guess we're going to have to hook up to the trailer and get it over there. Unless you really... Then things aren't exactly made for roading down the road. Unless... Uh, somebody is blocking the highway for you. I, I plan on just putting it on gooseneck here. We got the old 2017 model here. The Chevy. The Duramax. Maybe you guys can't hear it here. You hear that? I think I might have an exhaust issue. I'm going to have to look into that. While I'm thinking about it and getting ready here, make sure if you like this video, smash that like button. Thank y'all. I think I'm going to pull this way out over here. There we go. I'm actually extremely excited. This is the first time I get to operationally use that genie. I know you guys are like, uh, Steve, oh, that's kind of weird. I mean, I don't know. I can't. I think it's cool using this big equipment. I call it big equipment. Some people may call it a uh, really small equipment. But the funnest thing is, you get basically control this thing with stick drives, which is pretty cool. All right. Let's see. Start this up. Oh, 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 oh! Yeah, I still need to turn down that. It's a little bit too quick for my taste. Oop, wrong direction. There we go. Oh yeah. Here we go. Yep. This thing is actually very tall. I get a little bit wheezy when I'm fully extended. Let's do it here. Way up here. I mean, look at this. We are seriously very high. You can tell my legs are shaking. I mean, look at my stance right there. That's when you know somebody is grasping the handles with a death grip. All right, drive this thing on. I think I'm not exactly lined up put our hazard on because we can do dangerous stuff as soon as that thing's on. Ooh, yep, here we go. Alright, I, I kind of thought better of it. All my weight was to the front of this thing. And the front of the trailer, I mean. Definitely don't want that. Ooh, don't want to hit my head on that thing. All right, yep, that is definitely more weight balance. Okay, this thing is just right down the road, I believe. Uh, left. Oh, oh, I see the traffic jam already. We should be right. At least I hope so, at least. Man, no wonder they were in such a hurry. This kind of got... A major traffic jam going here. Oh, I see it up there. You see off in the distance there. Hmm. Where am I going to go at here? Uh, I guess, yeah. Put the blinkers on. I'm gonna have to uh, scoot up front. Sorry. Sorry to everyone, I know. Trust me, I'm not jumping in line. Yep, I think I'm gonna unload over here. Uh, car. Come on, buddy. There we go. Yeah, there we go. Now you got the ticket. Wait a second. That car has neon green lights underneath it. Yeah. Okay. A little bit odd. I thought that went out of style a while ago, but I guess everyone has their own. There we go. Unload the genie. I gotta jump up here. Jump there. Jump there. Alright, here 
here we go. Up and away. It looks like this is an old rope bridge. Kind of odd that they still have this. This is definitely a low-hanging bridge on this. Let's see if I can get up here. Here we go. All right, move this up a little bit. Here we go. Wait, wait. What are you doing? That guy just ripped over that bridge like nobody's business. Really, I mean, look at him go. Idiot. Idiot. I'm here and I just realize I'm on the wrong side here. Whoa, whoa, what are you doing? What the heck is going on here? guy's an idiot. I just realized I have to go on the other side of this bridge. And I almost hit them guard posts there. This around. Uh, this is... Look. They are coming. We got some tow trucks here. Hmm. That tractor sh must be incapacitated. Or broken down more like it. Okay, that's literally my trailer right there. Uh, uh, I think he wants me to move my trailer or move this. Which one do you want me to move? Uh, I guess he still wants me to move my trailer. All right, buddy. You could just uh, get out of your truck and actually ask me. Man, so rude. All right, let's go down quick here. All right, dude. It's it's on its way. Jeez. Holy cow! It's a diesel. It takes a little uh, massaging to start up. Yeah, I definitely have an exhaust problem on this truck. Is this far enough away for you? There you go. A little honk back there, buddy. Alright, started going here. Oh, wrong way. Yeah, what the heck? What? What the heck are they doing up there? Why are these people using that bridge still. Don't they see what's going on over here? Why would you be driving that three-wheeler? I guess that's the path they use. Alright, dude. I guess that's what this uh, bridge is for. Oh, ATV path? Oh my goodness. Talk about some bobbing and weaving. This thing is just like in real life. You about you bang around and everything there's sometimes you get the weavy jeezies on here. That's for sure. Alright. Guess we got to cut these lines loose over here. Oh, 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 oh. Yep, there we go. Man, we've got traffic over here too. Traffic everywhere. There we go. Good thing these are hydraulically powered. Get them out of the way quick. See? Just a push of the button. And we go up. And we should have no problem. Alright. Cut this loose up here. I'll reach down right there. I think we're loose. Uh, I might end up needing a crane to actually lift the bridge up off this thing. Uh, can I get his attention? Yo! Yo, buddy! Yo! Oh, man. I guess I'm gonna have to go down. Jumping up and wagging, waving my hands isn't getting nowhere. I don't 
really think that's a safe way to check up the bridge. I mean, ooh, don't think you are exactly flat on the surface there. Somebody hear a whistle? What the heck? Who's this guy? Uh, okay. Who is this guy? Hey, your uh, truck makes a kind of whistle, you know that? Uh, I guess the Mayberry foreman here did not like me bossing around his driver. Okay, Mr. Foreman. How about you decide how to lift up the bridge yourself? You know, just showing up to the job site, knowing exactly how what needs done. I'll step back and watch. Okay, after the foreman called his boss, his boss's boss, they kind of came under the same conclusion I did. It needs to go on the other side of the bridge. Big surprise. So glad. We can finally get somewhere. Alright. Let's see if I can hook him up here. Put this line up to the chain and hopefully be able to lift this bridge up. But thank you all for watching. And if you enjoy this type of video, please leave it down in the comments below. Thank you all. I will see you next time over here in the paradise. I just... I got to try it. I mean, these guys look like they're having too much fun. This kind of is a cool little track here. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Whoa, yeah, well, low bridge, duck. Oh, man, I almost caught my head right there. Yeah, pretty fun little uh, path. Now I understand why they never stop. But if you want to play with all these mods and more, make sure you check out Apex Game PCs. They make a PC specifically for your needs. Use the code SQUAD, save a ton. Later, y'all.